<gasps> it's a magical box. It's not the Oyatsu box, but it is a magical box. I'm in not a lot because I'm about to go and get changed into my cosplay. So this probably will go up before the cosplay stuff if you're watching on YouTube. If you're watching on Facebook, this is going to go up after the cosplay stuff. Confusing? Awesome. Great. That's how I would like to be. So again, I, I go to the Oriental Superstore down near Sandy to get all my bits and pieces if I ever kind of can't get to London or I need to restock on things because London is quite fast so me going dragging all food back from London isn't exactly appropriate so I need to show you this before I go anywhere oh this is my massive box so what happened was I went out a, a kind of just gonna get my normal stuff wasn't expecting there to be anything of any interest there and I, they decided to go and get new products how dare they and the issue with them getting new products is I want to try new products, so carry you back where you are. Oh, sorry, guys. Let me fiddle around with you for a minute. Would you sit still, guys? Are you guys up? Right. I might fast forward this bit. On there we go. We're back again. We're back. So new products equals spending more money. I was like, I'm going to be a really good girl. I'm not going to buy anything. I've got like cosplay stuff to get this month. I've got a hotel to pay for. Two hotels to pay for now. Um, but okay, cool. So this is the big box. I'm gonna go and talk through it just like I did last time. Um, if you find it interesting, yay. If you don't find it interesting, don't watch. Don't watch. Cool. First things first. This was reduced to clear, so I couldn't help myself. It is chicken ramen. It's just a hot chicken ramen bowl. Uh, most of the time, you can tell if something's hot because they'll have a character blowing fire. So good in indication if you're gonna be eating something hot and you don't like hot stuff. Stay away from birds blowing fire. So this one here um, is a ramen bowl, so this one will be with water. So you will be putting water in this one. So, onwards we go. I've got teriyaki chicken flavour crispies, just because I like teriyaki chicken. And I really enjoy their crisps, because their crisps always seem to be a bit more flavourful. And I love interesting flavour crisps. So if, at some point, if I ever get big enough, um, I'm going to try and do like different flavour, odd flavour crisps and try and different flavours and do food testing and stuff. I like food, so we'll try it. Okay, I'm so happy to find these. These are sausage bowls, uh, sausage rolls. So they're just, bur they're just like kind of rolls with sausages inside them. They've got a really nice glaze on them though, so I think it's the same glaze they put on their pork buns, which is really, really nice. Um, so yeah, I'm going to try these out. I didn't realise that, that the Oriental Superstop was doing so much in a way of cake and like savoury foods like this so that's why I went back and went I'm going to buy a lot more than I thought I was going to buy. Um, it's also they're selling moon cake at the moment so if you like moon cake get your butt down because it's not going to be for very long. It's basically new gifts for 2017 as obviously it's the new year kind of thing so grab your new bits and pieces and if you like moon cake stock up because you pop I've not seen moon cake in Oriental Super Superstore for a while. Um, I only like the non-egg version of mooncake. I won't eat egg version mooncake, so it sucks to be me. So I'm not getting any mooncake. Okay, again, we had these last time. These are chili, chili knickknacks. I love these so much. I had these and I, it just made me crave knickknacks, the spicy knickknacks. I haven't seen them in a while in the UK, so they probably are selling them. I'm just not looking, but I love knickknacks. Oh, it's so good my eye. So I'll hold that there for a minute. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully that's a thumbnail. I've been getting really ugly thumbnails lately. Chili knickknacks. I love chili knick. Oh, I lo they're not knickknacks. They look like chili knickknacks. They eat like chili knickknacks. They are corn puffs. They're better for you. I like chili knickknacks. Okay, okay. Onion rings. But these are red onion rings. So again, I like I like onion rings as next to the next person. So try them out. We've got some hot and spicy onion rings. Because again, you guys know I'm a bit of a spice fiend. I love spice. I, I just, I like food with an impact. I like food with flavour and I love it. I've got, these are Oreo. These, I know this doesn't look, uh, it was on the bottom there, but this is Oreo. These are chocolate covered wafers and they've got white chocolate drizzled over them. Oreo wafers, guys. Oreo. They had white version. And they also had the Oreo straws, the wafer straws, if you want to do them. So Oreo isn't just a biscuit. It's also a wafer and, yeah, I love Oreo. Okay, so before we descend into the madness of ramen, butter biscuits. 
<coughs> so I'll show you that on there. These are just butter cookies. I like butter. Um, <coughs> kind of dying in the moment. Still getting over it. I'm getting better, guys. So again, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure I recognise the tower, but I don't because in a lot of places decide to build towers. In Germany, there's towers everywhere, so this could be from. I'm not entirely sure where this is from. Um, back doesn't really help me a great deal either. This is China, so maybe it's somewhere in China. Um, in Asian countries, more like Japan, mainly Japan, they'll always, if you're hosting someone, if you've got a friend coming over your house, you'll always put a plate of biscuits on display because it's polite to offer them biscuits, it's polite to offer them green tea. Um, so butter cookies, these would happily be offered. You would offer these to your guests. I like butter cookies in the UK. I bet these are going to be just as good as the UK version. I had to stock up on some sweet chilli sauce. I recommend this this version. It's the May, is it May? May ploy version. I like this sweet chilli. This sweet chilli is really nice. It goes really well with pastry goods if you're going to dip anything. And yeah, so it's a sweet chilli sauce because I ran out. I had a big tub and I had a little bit left and it went out of date. So sad to be me. Right, we're going into ramen now. I'm going to... Should I go... F I'll go for bowls first because bowls are easier. So this is a new product they've just started getting in. It's the faux. These are a new range that they're doing. Um, they're kind of like thicker noodles, so quite thicker noodles. By Mama again. Mama is a maker. I think I haven't got any Mama noodles here. Um, Mama do do a basic range as well, but which are kind of like your equivalent to pot noodle. Um, so this is just chicken flavour. Uh, this one you add water to. I'm probably going to take this to work. I've got a few long days coming up. so And because I'm quite, getting quite lazy, even though I shouldn't be, I'm going to try and eat some of these at work. So I've also got, again, the ABCD one. Um, this is pho again. Uh, this is chicken onion. So you know I like, if I find them, because I can do two birds with one stone here. Yeah. Wrong one. <laughs> Wrong one! Right. I love onion chicken. You guys know I love onion chicken. This is my favourite flavour, ramen. This is onion chicken as well. So hopefully... This is going to be a match made in heaven. This is going to be love at first sight. This is going to be marriage. This is going to be marriage. This is my happy marriage partner. I am now a married lady. So, pop those down. I've got myself some pepper chicken. Because I haven't seen pepper chicken before. So, it's just probably like black pepper. On the front, it's just kind of like a sweet chicken they've got on it. I love it. These, again, you can have these with a bit of juice in the pan. Or you can just serve them with just the kind of the sauce, but I prefer having a bit of liquid in the bowl. Again, um, this is a hot spicy chicken one. It's got bean, um, that's lotus, that's a lotus root. That's hot chicken stuff. So it's vegetables, very vegetable dishy, and it's gonna have some liquid in it as well. So again, that's going for work for me. This isn't a hot one. So for once I haven't gone for something hot, I have got myself chicken. It's just normal chicken. So I add water to it, it's chicken flavour. Simple, simple, simple. Um, I, I think I told you guys where they came from last time, but again, this one's actually made in England, so... <laughs> it's an English version. This one here, if you're ever travelling to an Asian country, an airport, and you happen to have a VIP power, pop, lounge pass, they always sell the shin noodles. Everywhere you go, they sell these, so... They're just a very big flavour. I like shin noodles. They're very hot. Don't eat them if you hate hot food. There's no point. You're going to burn your mouth off. So, I've got myself, just because I told you guys, cup noodles. You just, you know, this is Nissan. This is Nissan, yeah. Nissan, Nissan. They have a cup noodle museum in Japan. I will go one day. So, I had to get myself at least one. I've got a beef flavour. This is your bog standard ramen. You can't get any more bog standard than this. Okay, so this is like your equivalent to pot noodle. I hate pot noodle. I only like one flavour, but I had it lately, and after having these noodles, I couldn't eat it. It was just gross. So, I think that's... Ah, I've got more. Ah, I've got pineapple cakes. I don't know how these are going to taste and how pineapple-y they are, but I like pineapple in cake, not on my pizza. So if Ruz is watching this, no. So yeah, this is just cake. Okay, and back into some ramen. I've got lots of ramen flavours. So, I've got beef ramen, which is served with liquid, which I look nice. It's very hot again, chilies. You know me, 
So one time I maybe I'll go shopping with you guys. I don't even I might even vlog as I go and show you what's on what I can get from my Oriental supermarket. The only reason I don't like vlogging is because I hate my face. I don't really like doing these. I initially my travel vlog videos, I'm barely in them. I hate showing my face to you guys because I know I've got wonky teeth, I know you're gonna pick up with it. And this is YouTube and it's full of trolls, so I know guys, it's not happening. Onion chicken again, because how much I love onion chicken, I've got two of those. So I put that away. I've got a really hot one. So you know that, that bowl I showed you guys with the hot bird on it? This is hot bird again, eating noodles. He's sweating. He is really hot. If you hate your spice, do not eat. So it's a hot chicken flavour ramen, served with the liquid this time again. Can't wait. I can't wait. Um, I think I've got two of those ones. Did I get two? Uh, no, I've got one. I also got chilli crisps. They are red. These crisps are physically red. Again, don't eat them if you hate spice, but I can't wait. I like chilies. They say they're really, really hot, so we will hold them to it and see how hot they really are. I've got some more chilli again. Sorry. I know people are like, she's obsessed with chilli. I am obsessed with chilli. I love chilli. Again, served with the liquid. It's just chicken flavour ramen. So, okay, I've got a few more left now, and... I don't think these are all hot. Okay, so one more hot one, and then I think that's just normal. So these are rice noodles. Rice noodles are fatter. You'll find they're thinner and they break really hard in your hand, but they're quite nice. I've got another rice noodle here. This is just your regular chicken noodle. I had this in a stir fry. They taste great in a stir fry. This is faux noodles. It's just, again, on the front. I just, that arrangement I would eat. If I was in Japan, I would eat that. Um, so, yep, yeah, it's just, I think this is beef. This is beef one. This is a beef stew kind of thing. I like beef. And I like rice noodles occasionally. It's just going to hurt my hand to break those. I've got duck flavour ramen. Beef flavour ramen. These two you can get hold of in the UK easily. Again, I told you about being on the UK campus in Hatfield. They sold these in our shop because we had quite an oriental kind of collection of students as well. So we're, we were quite international as a university, which is great. And I like this. So I'll pop those in there. Last but not least, pork stew with the liquid again. Not a very hot one. I'm guessing it's got a little bit of kick, but that's about it. So this is my haul from the Oriental Superstore, which is central. If you are in London, there's a big one in London. There's a big one in Milton Keynes, which has a edible food court, if you want to go and eat the food court. If I can go to Milton Keynes, I will, because I want to eat the food. So if I can get to Milton Keynes, I'll try. Maybe on one of my days off, I'll get a bus to Milton Keynes and go and have a look. So I might do that for you guys. So now I'm going to go and get changed into my cosplay. It's going to take me a while to get the makeup on, but I'm looking forward to it. It's a sunny day outside. I might get myself some nice pictures out in a garden, and I'm going to film a bit of it. So watch out for that, and I'm recovering slowly. So thank you for watching, and I hope you are feeling hungry now. <coughs> and I will see you guys in another video. Ciao!